Here we have a really cool effect, free for Reactor, the VHS audio degradation suite, man. So let's check it out real quick here. So we're taking this otherwise good sounding piano and running it through basically, you know, say VHS tape here. Lots of different options here. So pre, we have post. We actually don't even have to have anything playing back, but here's your input button or your input knob. Turn that down for your input. You can hear the noise even without anything playing back. So we can have hum, different kinds of hum, hiss, crackle, noise. Got pre and post on this. You can adjust the overall volume there. Then we have tone, drive, compression, highs and lows, the split between that, saturation, warp, all kinds of cool stuff here. So I'll put maybe chorus on. We can really make this sound like a like a worn out VHS tape there. We can make this mono. Which is pretty cool too. Just the flutter. Really wear it out. Even have a mic emulation here. <laughs> Turn that on. Look at all of these different uh, responses we have. These are mic emulations that we have. Plus we have a bunch of different presets there. This is absolutely free, man. Let's check it out on a couple other sources and then I'll show you where to get it. We can come back here and maybe we want to put it on drums, for example. So if we have this on drums, so right now we have BFD3 up playing back some drums. Bypass this for now. So good sounding drums, but maybe we want these to sound like we're from the 1950s or something. There we go. Maybe we're on a late night show. Really big shoe, really big shoe. Just the however you want. Tons of different options here. Sounds great on a ton of different sources. Even sounds good on pads. Really long evolving pads. So I'll bypass that for now again. This nice pad that evolves. You can just add some degradation into that. Make it sound maybe a little more interesting for whatever you happen to be doing. Maybe you need to set up some kind of a, uh, like an old time voice or something. Let me mute that. So here's is a project I worked on uh, in the past. And right now I'll just bypass it. But you can get both of these absolutely uh, for free. So it sounds good like that, but let's go ahead and turn this on. And we can make this sound like the audio was from the 20s or something. But you can get both of these absolutely uh, for free. Let's check them out real quick here. So we have free HD orchestra. All right, so that's pretty much it here, man. A really cool effect. Crazy that this is actually free, man. And you can get this over here at the Reactor user library. This link will be in the description below. Download it, and whenever you download it, there's no installation. You'll just take the file and throw it wherever you want, okay? If you throw it in your user library folder over here in Player, you can, of course, access it uh, from that location. Or if you do not put it in your user library, you can always come to Files and then just locate that file and throw it in there, and you're ready to rock and roll with this really cool free effect for Reactor. Just check the description below for the link.